Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So I've been posting over the last couple of months about our next annual feature update, Windows 11 version 24H2, which is going to have a lot more AR, artificial intelligence, integrated more deeply into the OS, according to Microsoft. And as I've mentioned previously, Microsoft is concentrating on bringing a lot more AR into future versions of Windows 11 or any future version of Windows, be that Windows 12 in the next year or two. Now, just to let you know that I have a couple of more details um, regarding um, AR rolling out to future versions of Windows. And this is according to a post by Windows Central, which I'll leave down below, where they have given us a couple of details on Windows 11's upcoming AR features that apparently will include a new AR Explorer experience and that's obviously if you have the relevant hardware to support the so-called um, AR Explorer which will be the next generation NPUs which stands for neural processing units which um, can support enhanced AR performance. Now just a bit of a backtrack here before we have a, a quick look at what they've discussed is that until now as you may well know Microsoft's Copilot um, in the OS basically has worked um, on a software level and needs the internet to function um, if you are doing searches and so on and wanting more info regarding different um, images or files. Now, despite the AR Explorer that Windows Central posted on, it actually has nothing to do with the File Explorer. Um, it's got nothing to do with the actual File Explorer. But um, what it will do, and just to give you a couple of examples, is according to Windows Central sources, AI Explorer is the next kind of key AI experience, um, they are terming this experience, that will separate AI PCs from non-AI PCs. And it's basically described as an advanced co-pilot with a built-in history timeline feature that turns everything you do on your computer into a searchable moment using natural language. So this is going to be very similar to the built-in timeline feature we've got going currently on Windows 10 and also Windows 11, but obviously using an enhanced AR performance to get the job done. Apparently, it will also work across any app and allow you to search for previously opened conversations, documents, web pages, and images. So basically, um, it will record and help you search through all the previous actions you performed on your PC making um, every moment searchable, basically. So basically, a, a souped-up version of the task view and your timeline. Now, something else they've also mentioned is it will also understand context. So it will also even suggest tasks based on what's currently on your screen. So they give an example. So suppose you're looking at an image in an app. In that case, the AI Explorer will automatically show an edit image button that lets you type out your criteria, such as remove this image's background using the Photos app. So as I've mentioned previously, this AI um, using neural processing units, NPUs, um, is going to be a lot more uh, embedded into the OS. So it's basically going to become part of the shell. So um, although it's got nothing to do with File Explorer, it will be more embedded in future in the File Explorer, in the Start menu, in your taskbar, uh, in your task view timeline, where currently, as mentioned, it only kind of works on a OS level and needs the internet to function. So that's where the major enhancement with all this is taking place. And um, as mentioned, these new AR features are expected to roll out as part of the Windows 11 version 24H2 feature update, originally rumored to be Windows 12, but obviously that has all changed. And I'll leave a Windows 12 playlist uh, in the end screen of this video if you'd just like to get some more info and I'll also leave a Windows 24H2 playlist in the end screen of this video um, if you'd also like to um, play catch up regarding the annual feature update that Microsoft is rolling out um, later this year. So that's according to the post by Windows Central as mentioned which will be down below and that's that the Windows 11 24H2 will incorporate upcoming AR features, including this new AR Explorer experience, which is going to be interesting to see how this all bundles out. And like most things, if I get any more info, obviously I'll post and let you know. And I can already see that this is going to be causing a lot of debate 
uh, in certain circles. And I certainly hope that Microsoft does give us, if your hardware does, um, if your hardware does uh, basically support this new AR Explorer, that it's going to, they're going to give us a toggle to be able to turn this off. And that's going to be an interesting one to see if they actually give us the option to be able to turn this AI Explorer that's going to be bundled more into the shell of your OS, if, they, if we will have an option to be able to turn that off. But nonetheless, with all things like Microsoft, as I always say, only time will tell. So thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one.